What is up guys, Trex here, and welcome to another episode of Trex Plays. This time we'll be playing the game Magicka, an adventure of sorts. I just noticed that coffee has really weird looking shadows on the inside. And it has a, like a really weird, weird low textured glass. Actually all this is kind of like weird, like this pipe has some weird low textures. It may just be that it looks, that there's no like um reflections on it or anything, but it all just kind of looks kind of dull. But anyways, this is Magica, an adventure of sorts, brought to you by Paradox Interactive. Uh, they published this game. They also published a small little game that I like to call City Skylines, which is quite fantastic. But, but anyways, I believe, I've never played this game before, but I believe you have to combine elements to fight things. So I, I, I know that you can fight you can fight baddies in Vietnam in some place, but that's really all I know about this game. But anyways, on to the adventure. If you wanted this to be a Reddit robe, you ha you'd have to have 200% more cats. I don't want to read about no reservoir dogs, I mean wizards. I think we'll just stick with the vanilla robe for now and see how that works out for us. Let's uh, see what colors they have. They have uh, gray, that is the exact color of this text box background. There's black, white, blue, uh, brown, hook em, pink, yellow, green, darker green, lighter blue, uh, slightly darker lighter blue, a purple, a maroon, and a red. I think we'll go as the slightly darker lighter blue. Chapter 1. The Phantom Menace. I mean, the Fancy Menace. The main quest of this game is to seek the cure to the blackface disease which causes all these wizards to be cursed with terrible, terrible blackface. Imprisoned at the world's end. I'm pretty sure that's the plot of Pirates of the Caribbean 3. Aside from the increased number of monsters attacking the good villagers. Oh no, that was just children. Oh, your name's Vlad. Well, hello, comrade. Alright, we have finally gained control of our character, and how do we move? Unfortunately, this game suffers from Age of Empires Edge of the Map disease, where everything outside of the map is just pure, dark, empty, void. Why are you sitting by yourself? Is it because you're different? No, you just have to believe that there is no spoon. All of these wizards speak exactly like The Sims. What are these books? 1984, Slaughterhouse 5, Heart of Darkness, Diary of a Wimpy Kid. Man, you're reading some dark stuff. Surrender! Yay! Um, yeah. um, We're almost out of cheese. I see one, two, three wheels, and a slice. Bonita. This is just The Sims. And I'm dead. I have obtained a sword. So I just got the Earth spell, and essentially it's a suicide button. Yeah. Yeah, I am very dead. Die, Nazi scum! Oh wait, this isn't Wolfenstein. Apparently, wizards suffer from John Marston Syndrome, where they die every time they touch water that goes above their kneecaps. Kami, Kami, ha! What happens when you combine lightning and earth? You die. Ah oh, yes, the most notable element of them all. Arcane. So apparently my greatest enemy is my own incompetence and not an actual monster. <sighs> I should probably wear a helmet every time I go outside from now on. A long time ago in a galaxy far, far away. An old wizard thought it would be a good idea to have this masher installed. It hasn't proven to be that useful, though. I think that wizard might have been the headmaster of some sort of school of wizardry. What was the name of it? Hey boss, how do we make this game appeal to kids? Uh, put a K in the word magic. Brilliant, Jim. Alright guys, I want you guys to stop mining and I want you to start building our World Cup stadiums. Let's go! Do you wanna build a snow goblin? Is this our first boss fight? Oh, that was easy. 
Oh, stop giving me so many achievements for the same thing! If I push spacebar, the video could end right now. Wait, where'd I go? And I died! I've discovered the laser fire healing beam spell thing! Whoa, it's like one of those tunnels from Portal. What the heck did I just do? Hey, uh, could you guys teach me how to, like, raise my voice and, like, shout at people? Because I have this issue where I have to talk really quietly. I really need to learn how to shout. And so I think you guys would be able to help me. You wonder what's behind that door? Guess if I'm out. Oh, you guys should never find out. Well, stand back and you will find out soon enough. Hold on, give me a second. And... Ha! Oh. I'm sorry. I guess you never will find out. You, you come here every morning so that you may have the honor of saving the world one day? <laughs> well, put those dreams aside because they're not going to happen. Okay, now they're not going to happen. A Canadian just the shed a single tear. Well, anyways, guys, that was Magicka, and as I descend these steps and reascend them, I will do the outro. Uh, I, I really like that game. I'm going to keep playing this, because that was really enjoyable, and, um, it is very pretty. This game looks really nice. But anyways, uh, Magicka 2 just came out. It is getting mixed reviews, but I recommend picking this one up, because out of the 30 minutes I played it, it is quite a bit of fun, and I look forward to playing through the rest of the game. So anyways, guys, if you like this video, then be sure to like the video and subscribe to my channel for some more awesome content. This video is pre-recorded because I am probably currently gone. Uh, there will be, uh, depending on what happens next... I don't know what's going to happen, but tomorrow there will be an episode of Terraria 1.2 of JXW, hopefully. And the next episode of Trex Plays will be the Saturday after this one comes out. So anyways, guys... Thank you all so much for watching. If you liked the video, then you should like the video and subscribe to my channel for some more awesome content. I will see you all next time, and goodbye. Dang it, you need to die!